For this lesson, I'm going to talk about using ProDiscover to image a USB flash drive. When computers are seized during a forensic investigation, the first process of extracting information involves the use of disimaging to perform a bit stream duplication of the original storage device. Disimaging builds forensically legal exact bit for bit copies of the original data, including the MFT, which is the master file table, with all the physical file locations containing existing data or remnants and unallocated free space on the hard disk. After the original disk is duplicated, investigators can safely analyze the file structure and recover potential forensic evidence without the danger of destroying potential evidence during the process. Additionally, disk imaging maintains the chain of custody by protecting the original data from any changes that might render it legally unusable in court. ProDiscover supports several types of image formats including DD, EVE, CMP, PDG, and PDS that can be imported into ProDiscover or other forensic analysis software to search for specific evidence during an investigation. So in the demo I'm going to show you, we will simulate the seizure of digital evidence on a USB flash drive and build a ProDiscover.eve image that will be used during a forensic investigation to search for existing or deleted files. This process is exactly the procedure you would follow during an actual investigation, except that you would use a write blocking device to prevent any changes to the original evidence during the acquisition process. A write blocking device is a hardware or software component inserted between the original storage device and the computer capturing the image to prevent any information from being written to the original storage device. Remember, anything overwriting it would violate the chain of custody. Now then we're going to use ProDiscover to image a USB flash drive and image it into a .eve image format. Okay, for this demo, I'm going to show you how to image the evidence USB flash drive. So first, we want to create a new folder called Work on the C drive. Inside the work folder, we want to create a, another folder called labs. Inside the labs folder, we'll create three more folders called cases, data, and evidence. All right, now that's set up. Now we want to run ProDiscover. Go to the action. Click on capture image. All right, for the source, select our USB evidence drive, which is the H drive. Click here. Let's navigate to our folder that we created earlier, work, labs, Evidence. We're going to name this C2 Project 2. All right, for the technician name, let's type our full name. All 
And then the in image number field, we'll type in C2 project 2. Click OK. And right now it's currently imaging, as you can see, capture images. Okay, the image capture is completed. Hit OK. Let's navigate back to our folder that we created earlier in the evidence folder. As you can see, the C2 Project 2.eve image has been created.